<laughs> Willie Taggart was hoping to do last week, just fell behind so quickly. And this time he's dropped in the backfield. Jonathan Butler and Jordan Ferguson combined for the TFL. Amir Rasul is the one in the backfield again. Vadiado will keep it and sling it over the middle. And the pass is caught by Isaiah Gathings, who spent three years at Gardner Webb. Looking to get Middle Tennessee State on the board for the first time this evening. And that's what he does. 61 seconds remaining on third and 10. And Delello will keep it. Delello out near midfield. That's what he does best. And he is brought down. Let's see if Middle Tennessee decides to use a timeout here. They do not. On a monster run for 12 in white, 31 yards. A good read from Delello on the zone read. Keep it. Have that long run of 31. He'll flip it to Lane, who will flip it back. And there goes Ali, Youssef Ali across the 40 and across midfield. Ali with a head of steam across the 30, following the blocker. Just using Jimmy Marshall, directing him in which way to go. And a big play on first down for the Blue Raiders. MTSU opening up the playbook with the reverse to Ali. And watch the blocks out in front here. Delello, the quarterback, gets one. Ja'Kai Graham, the left tackle, helping out Ali. And then Jimmy Marshall. Good job by Ali using those blocks. 60 yards on first down. And there goes Delello. And then he is tripped up. Got that jumbo backfield. And there goes Delello. And he is in the end zone. One yard run. Little delayed call from the officials, and Mike Delello has Middle Tennessee back in this one. Sets up the touchdown. It's Mobley on the previous play coming right up the middle. He at the five yard line, he's in that pile. And then Mobley driving his legs in the offensive line, pulling him along, gets him inside the one. There's Perry under pressure. DQ Thomas takes him down. His fourth sack of the season. Get off a final play before the end of the quarter. And a big handoff to Martel Petaway. Petaway still going across midfield. And he never went down. Petaway keeps his feet using FAU defenders to roll his way all the way down inside the 10. Wow. Watch Martel Petaway. Breaks one tackle there. Think you got him? Nope. 65 yards using TJ Young to help him out along the way. And it is a 17-13 game. Got 16 and a half tackles for a loss on the season. Does Ferguson a team high seven and a half sacks? Lane lets it bounce and Lane has it across the 40 yard line. Jalen Lane, second in the country in yards per punt return, has himself a beauty here. Third and five. He's got all day over the middle. That's a first down and more. Isaiah Gathings. Driving those legs, are you kidding me? Inside the 10. Got that jumbo package in here with the defensive lineman in as eligible receivers. Wow, and it pays off. Are you kidding? Zaylin Wood for the touchdown. 96 in white, right side of the screen. And look at this throw by Delello with Lassiter all over him and an outstanding catch by Zaylin Wood, his teammates looking to get a big win of his own. Perry's under pressure, look out, DQ Thomas was there, and it's picked up by Ferguson. Jordan Ferguson is on his way. Jordan Ferguson is in the end zone. And this Blue Raiders defense has its sixth touchdown of the season. What a time. And Jordan Ferguson, the all-everything defensive end, likely gives Middle Tennessee State another week of football. Look at Jordan Ferguson rumbling down the field. What a game.
he has had with the flu. A 6'2", 262-pounder from Atlanta, Georgia. Perry's under pressure again. Has to just loft it up, and it's picked. And that'll do it. Great, great, the interception. The 16th of the season for Middle Tennessee, and for great, his third of the year. Blitz coming right up the middle, 42 in white, causing that pressure. Great game from Ferguson. That's every coach's favorite formation. And Rick Stotskill picks up win number 100 in a game that makes Middle Tennessee bowl eligible. And for FAU, a deflating end to a season that started five and three and finishes five and seven. So Middle Tennessee, Bowl eligible for the 10th time in the last 13 years and first time since 2018.